हाई एवरीबडी वेलकम बैक टू विमल सर जी यूट्यूब चैनल दिस इज क्वेश्चन फ्रॉम क्लास नाइन कंपलसरी मैथमेटिक्स एक्सरसाइज टुवेल्व पॉइंट टू सैमल्टेनियस इक्वेशन चैप्टर एलेवेन बी अ फ्यू नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स आर मेड टू स्टैंड इन अ सर्टेन नंबर ऑफ रोज इक्वली इफ थ्री मोर स्टूडेंट्स वेर केप्ट इन इच रो देन देर वुड बी टू रोज लेस इफ थ्री लेस स्टूडेंट्स वेर केप्ट इन इच रो देर वुड बी थ्री रोज मोर फाइन द नंबर ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स सोल्यूशन A few number of students are made to stand in a certain number of rows equally if three more students were kept in each row. So we have to suppose here let let number of let number of students let number of students in each row. Is equal to x. Okay, let number of students in each row is equal to x, and number of rows is equal to is equal to y. Because we have suppose this x because there is three more three more students were kept in each row. Suppose we uh, suppose uh, we suppose that number of students in each row is x, and number of rows y. Then now by the first condition, x and y. So uh, we can now uh, say that find the number of students. Therefore, we can write here. Therefore, number of students. Number of students is equal to. Number of students in each row is x, and now number of rows is y. That that means product of these two is the number of students. So x multiply y is equal to the number of students. Now by the first condition, by first given condition, first condition is here. If three more students were kept in each row. If three more students were kept kept in each row, so row is our row. Our if three more students were kept in each row, then there would be two rows less. There would be two rows less. So rows less means uh, this is our number of students. So in X. Number of students. If three more students were added, means x plus three. Three more students are added. If three more students were kept in each row, there would be two rows less. There would be two rows less. That means in row. Uh, that means here number of rows is y. So the number of rows there would be two rows less. That means rows will be. Decrease by two less, and the product of these two is equal to same because the number of students will not alter; it will be constant x y only, same. We have written here x plus three because there is three more students were are kept. X is the number of students. In number of students, if three is added, then Number of rows will be two less means y minus two, and the product of these two will be same constant only. So this is the tricky part here. Now we will try to write it. Solve this. Uh, x plus three two times. Copy it. X plus three two times, and this y here, and this minus two here is equal to x y. Is equal to x into y. X y plus three y minus two x minus plus minus three two x six is equal to x y. This is equal to cancel. This this x y x y cancel. So this implies here minus two x plus three y is equal to minus six. When it comes, this side will be here plus six. Equation one. By second condition. Second 
given second condition is here if three less students were kept if three less students were kept that means total uh, number of students is x number of students uh, in uh, each row is x if three students if three less students were kept three less means x minus 3 and were kept in each row there would be three rows more three rows more means row is y then rows will be what there would be three rows more more means plus 3 and the product of these two will be same x y only if we solve this part copy this x minus 3 two times this y here this plus 3 here x y as it is imply x into y x y minus 3y plus 3 into x 3x plus minus minus 3 is 9 is equal to x y x y x y cancel implies this 3x minus 3y is equal to this minus 9 when it goes this side it will be plus 9 this is uh, this is uh, here here we can cancel uh, this is our equation 2 we can cancel this because coefficient of y is 3 and here also 3 so this is plus and minus so if we add we can easily cancel this therefore adding equation 1 plus equation 2 means adding implies this 3x minus 3y is equal to 9 and this minus 2x plus 3y is equal to 6 minus when this this minus will change into plus this plus minus and this this is plus so this will be minus sorry we are going to add here plus so no need to change the sign if we are subtracting generally we should change the sign so there is a minus and plus so this will be automatically cancelled uh, this is 3x minus 2x means this is x 9 and 6 will be 15 x is equal to 15 now put value put x is equal to 15 in equation 1 this implies this minus 2 into x is 15 so 15 plus 3y is equal to 6 implies minus 2 into 15 minus 30 plus 3y is equal to 6 implies 3y is equal to 6 this minus 30 when it comes this side it will be plus 30 implies 3y is equal to 36 this implies y is equal to 36 divided by this 3 is equal to 12 3 yeah 12 therefore this implies y is equal to 12 we got number of students in each row x that is 15 so 15 this is 15 and number of rows is equal to 12 therefore uh, uh, we can find the number of students find the number of students therefore we can write here therefore the number of students the number of s t u d e n t s number of students is equal to x y but x is equal to here 15 y is equal to 12 15 12 is equal to 15 tens are 150 and 30 so 180 this is our required answer If you have any queries in any steps please feel free to comment in the comment box I will try to reply in my youtube channel you can check other videos a lot of solutions are uploaded up to class 12th 
सी यू इन द नेक्स्ट वीडियोज राधे राधे जय श्री कृष्ण